Hey there, and welcome to JSA TV Live, the newsroom for telecom and data center professionals. I'm Dean Perrine at JSA, and we are coming to you live on location in Fort Lauderdale, Florida at MetroConnect 2023. And I'm here with Mr. Jim Bowie. Jim is the president and CEO of Involta. Jim, welcome to JSA TV. Thanks, Dean. Glad to be here. It's nice and warm. Beats Colorado. Yeah, it beats Northwest Indiana, <laughs> where I'm from, too. I'm not going to lie about it. There was a blizzard right before I was leaving. But anyway, Jim, uh, for our viewers that don't already know, why don't you tell them a little bit about Involta? You bet. So we're celebrating our 15th year in business here at Involta. We are a data center company uh, with 12 data centers. We build, own, and operate. We have, uh, we're building 44,000 fiber miles and uh, just one of those companies that focuses on enterprises in the secondary and mm -hmm. tertiary markets, really delivering digital transformation. Digital transformation, we hear a lot about that, and I suspect we're going to hear a lot more about that as the uh, the world transforms. We're hearing, you know, chat GPT, I'm going to be talking to a bunch of people about, about this, but that, that transformation, that's one of the things that people are going, oh, what? I'm not sure I understand that. But uh, to, to what... <laughs> For, for this interview, why don't you tell us a little bit about uh, some of the uh, the latest coming out of the newsroom over there. I understand that there was some big executive hire too. Yeah, so we promoted Carl Gordelich to our uh, chief financial officer. Really, Carl's been in the industry for more than 15 years uh, from the beginning, and he has really been instrumental, not only in our debt financing, but in, we're celebrating our one-year anniversary with our equity sponsor, Carlisle, uh, and Carl Gordelich was very instrumental in getting that equity deal done as well with Carlisle. So very proud to see him promoted. That's great. That's wonderful. Uh, and it says a lot about the company too, as you're, as yeah. you are uh, advancing on your, on your company goals, you know, lifting up the, uh, the personnel and stuff like that. So um, wonderful. Uh, speaking of, you are in high demand right now. I understand that you were speaking on the edge strategies for next generation networks tomorrow correct tomorrow. here at metro connect why don't you tell our viewers a little bit about yeah, that yeah so 4 4 50 p.m uh local time and really just excited like you know ever edge has been quite a buzz buzzword it is right? yep you know and, and, and volta has been at the edge uh, before it was cool we should have named the company edge volta <laughs> because we've been in low latency i know a good branding company <laughs> <Right? you know? laughs> but we've been in this game a long time and i think there are some uh use cases for enterprises that mm -hmm. are very interesting, both in healthcare and manufacturing, as compute needs to be closer to deliver patient outcomes mm -hmm. in the case of healthcare or in manufacturing, really just producing goods better, cheaper, faster. And if you've heard of industry 4.0 in manufacturing or smart manufacturing, really delivering technology to key, uh, key verticals, uh, there's some real stuff there. So I encourage everybody yeah. to tune in to that panel. We have some great panelists. and really discussing what's real and what's really happening on the edge today. Yeah, to me, that is the definition of transformation. When you were talking about patient outcomes and, and the real change that can happen when you get that kind of compute right next to uh, the, the origination, that's life-changing, literally life-changing. <laughs> um, so very, very cool. Um, why don't you tell us a little bit about what's ahead for Involta? What can we expect to, to hear or see from you in the next 12 to 18 months? Yeah, well, I'm excited to announce uh, here at Metro Connect that we have uh, dropped our latest version of a new product, and it's Disaster Recovery as a Service. Mm -hmm. And really, we focus on creating a differentiating uh, capability of both reliability and flexibility. So our disaster recovery product sits in our tier three concurrently maintainable facilities that we build, own, and operate. Mm -hmm. So that's a big differentiator. And then really it's about flexibility. When we saw the marketplace for disaster recovery, really two things are challenges for people. I think it's the uh, flexibility in terms of the services. So we have, um, if you would like, a, a self-guided model, mm -hmm. if you will, for that service or if you need engineering level expertise to actually build the plan, create, uh, declare disasters. Uh, so flexibility in that regard. And also, if anyone who has been in the disaster recovery space knows that clients don't want to buy it until something bad happens. <laughs> but what they should know is that, I'm going to give you a number, per minute, um, downtime can cost you between $900 a minute to $17,000 a minute. a minute. So if you don't have a disaster recovery plan, you're going out of business. So the other flexibility in the product we're launching allows people to step into their disaster recovery plan. What I mean by that, rather than 100% coverage of all of your mission critical 
data, you can do a 25% to get the most critical, 50% and 100%. So you can kind of step into. So I think reliability and flexibility, I think we're industry leading in what we're doing in disaster recovery. I've never recovery. heard of that ever. This is the first time yeah, anyone has ever said we had this tiered approach to uh, disaster recovery. And that's what it's about for us. It's customers giving customers choice. And we feel like we've created a matrix uh, that is really top notch for the industry. No, excellent, excellent. Um, I'd love to talk to you more about that. That's yeah. very, very cool. Um, but for our viewers that want to learn more, as I do, about Involta, where should they go? You bet. www.involta.com. Awesome, Jim. Thanks for being here. Thanks, Dean. You bet. You bet. And thank you, viewers, for watching JSA TV Live. We'll see you soon.